Um, I think we've coped with it very well. Um, I know that there was a lot made last time we was in Europe that, that we probably, our league form stuttered a little bit. Um, but I think this season we have coped, coped very well. I've pers personally, I've actually enjoyed it. I think it brings more of a focus. You, you've got no time to, to ease up on your focus um, in either competition. So um, I think from that point of view, it's very good. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't. Um, from from uh, my view is that we go into every game to health a level, as you say, and uh, whether we need to need a result or or we don't need a result, you you wanna. There's always a reason to win a game, whether whether that's to to progress in a tournament, whether that's to keep the the winning mentality. Um, it's it, it's never good to to lose a game, so. It can only it can only be be a negative to lose a game. So, no, I think I think we need to uh, we need to go there with with a good mentality and um, and get a positive result. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think we, we have spoken uh, about what a good opportunity it is for us. Um, we've seen um, English clubs do well, do well in it in previous years, and um, uh, and we're looking to, to to do the same. I think as well, it's good for the squad. Obviously, we we've got a very big squad here. If we just if we was just fighting on on one front, then it's going to um, decrease game time for players, and um, and then that that leaves players unhappy. Whereas I think. Now we're, we've got so many games, um, obviously with, with the European competition now and then going into, uh, into December with the, the hectic um, Christmas and festive period, it's, there's just games um, every few days and that means players, uh, players are needed, whether you're, um, whether you're a regular or, or on the fringes, everybody's going to be needed and, uh, and that helps, that helps the squad, that helps the manager's decision and, um, uh, and that can only be a positive. Uh, yeah, firstly, yeah, I, I, I do think that um, the the Europa League is is going to be going to be special this year. I think obviously we're we're looking to do do really well in it and and go as far as we, as we can, and and that in itself will create um, special moments during during games. And obviously, it probably takes the gloss off it with with the the fans not being there, um, and it probably probably wouldn't look as good, but. Uh, we as a group of players are, uh, are just as determined as uh, as what we would be if it was in the Champions League with a, a full uh, a full stadium. So um, we've got that platform, that opportunity there to to create something something special and uh, and put ourselves further in in Leicester folklore. Um, yeah, it's it's obviously something different to to what I've been used to in recent years. But um, the, there has been times where I've I've played there before. Um, 
the, uh, the manager and the, the coaching staff have been very good uh, with me in terms of helping me with, with positioning and where I should be at certain times defensively um, and, and deciding when, when's good to press higher up the, up the pitch and, uh, and staying back. And um, I think that it, it's, it's a big case of decision making when, when you're actually on the pitch. Um, but yeah, I've been getting getting plenty of help, and um, I'm I'm enjoying I'm enjoying playing, and uh, I'm I'm working hard every day in training to to make sure that I'm I'm in and around uh, the the team, and um, I'm I'm making the the manager's um, selection decisions harder for him, so it's uh, it, it's good good for me.